Top Gear Drift Legends wants to be a fun game about careering maniacally around a track, scoring points for the amount of time you spend sideways. That's what it wants to be. But all we know is, when a game manages to make drifting not that much fun, it's ran out of gas somewhere along the line. There are moments, moments when you're sideways and the dirt is flying through the air and you cannot help but smile. But they're always bookended by teeth gnashing frustration. You'll hit a rock, not notice, lose all your points and have to start the level again. It's part time trial, part score chase. Each of the short levels involves skidding through some zones, getting as many points as you can and getting to the finish line before the timer ticks down. Finishing a lap isn't the difficult part though. It's making sure you've done enough skids. Yellow zones double your points if you slide through them and chaining together drifts will see your multiplier skyrocketing. The problem is that after a few levels, you'll know full well that making a single mistake will prohibit you from getting the requisite score to move on. So you'll often find yourself reaching for the retry button after less than a second. Then there's the collision detection, or rather the fact that the only way you know you've hit something you're not supposed to is when you notice that all the points you've been accruing in your epic slide haven't gone onto your total. The controls don't really do anything to help either. They should be smoother than a greased up cheetah, but instead they feel like you're wrestling a recalcitrant bison that's annoyed it didn't get the steak it ordered. Almost everything here is a misstep. Unlock a new car and you need to go back and do all the levels you've already completed. Sometimes you can avoid the finish line, do a bit more skidding to top up your score, then cross the line to complete a level. It's not smart, it's not easy to play, and perhaps most devastatingly of all, it's not any fun. And on that bombshell, that's the biggest sin of all. Yeah.